Hey, it's Mike from BetterDigestion.org, and I'm going to share some interesting information with you today about cinnamon and how it can actually lower blood sugar and reduce your risk of diabetes. Uh, so you know cinnamon as um, the, the spice that you put on food, whether it be sweet or savory. Um, we all know cinnamon as the powder we put on oatmeal or other foods that we love. Uh, however, information from scientists around the world are now showing that there may be more to cinnamon than we initially understood or even thought. So I'm going to show you some of that information and show you how it can really um, lower your blood sugar and um, reduce your risk of diabetes. I want to share some more information with you later so I'm going to put a, a link on the screen and in the, the description below and you can click on that anytime and, and um, access a, a free ebook uh, with more tips and information about lowering blood sugar. So let's talk about uh, cinnamon and how it actually can affect your your blood sugar. Uh, what is cinnamon? It's actually a bark and it comes from um, trees for, in China in Southeast Asia and in India all over the place and most of us uh, like I said I've seen the the um, powdered variety, but it also comes in sticks and more recently it's starting to show up in supplements and uh, capsule form for people to use as uh, a way to improve their health and, and protect against um, high blood sugar. So what's interesting about many of the recent scientific studies is that cinnamon is proved to be very good at lowering and controlling fasting blood sugar levels. So your blood sugar when you're not eating or when you haven't eaten right away, um, cinnamon is, is showing to be effective in managing the, the blood sugar throughout uh, periods of, between meals I should say. Uh, if you are diabetic or pre-diabetic, you understand how important managing blood sugar levels are. If you're looking to get in shape and lose weight and improve health, you really need to pay attention to your blood sugar levels because they impact all of those things. Um, you know, and if you're one of the people who think you're not at risk, you, you should really think again. Uh, there's roughly 80 million Americans, roughly 25% of the population, that already have elevated fasting blood sugar levels. Um, in other words, they're approaching pre-diabetes or they're maybe pre-diabetic already and, and don't even know it. Uh, so cinnamon has been used for a lot of medicinal purposes. Uh, it's been used to lower cholesterol levels which in turn lowers uh, heart disease. It's been used to treat inflammation. Uh, it's been linked to improving um, neurological conditions like Alzheimer's or Parkinson's. And um, now it's being reported as a real powerful deterrent for high blood sugar. Um, you know, research is showing that if you ingest between one and three teaspoons of cinnamon per day, it will provide a, a relief or a steadying of your blood sugar levels. Uh, that seems like a lot of, of cinnamon, so you may want to look to a supplement or a natural uh, supplement form. However, uh, it's easy to ignore, to, to ignore uh, health conditions, especially if we haven't been diagnosed with them, but you want to look to be proactive in this case. Uh, include cinnamon in your diet and, and find uh, or just experience how it lowers blood sugar and, and inflammation and puts you on the track to feeling great and, and improved health. So I'm going to show you uh, that download that we talked about at the beginning. It's called Four Sneaky Tricks to Lower Your Blood Sugar. And in addition to cinnamon, there's a number of tips and information uh, that you should know to help you improve your health and to lose weight, burn fat. Um, you know, inside this free download, uh, it comes in your email and it shares specific exercises and uh, tips to increase your insulin sensitivity and lower your blood sugar. Uh, it shows how certain ingredients that you may have in your house right now or, or are certainly easily available at a grocery store decrease blood sugar by up to 25%, maybe even 30%. And uh, like I said, it's free, so go ahead and click through it. You have nothing to lose, and we are highly recommending this report for you. So 
Thanks for listening. This is Mike from BetterDigestion.org. Take care.